Hi guys, it's Carl here from Game, and welcome to another Game Plays. Today we are playing Halo 5 Guardians, and it's here, well, it's nearly here. It comes out Tuesday, I cannot wait to play this. I can't wait to get my copy, but right now we're going to be playing through the first campaign level, and I can't wait to do this. We're going to be playing as Locke, as, and um, yeah, let's get into this. I'll see you when we're in there. So here we are guys, like I said, we're playing this lock, fire team Osiris. We've got a few buddies with us and um, some elites to kill. Oh, okay. Never mind, we don't have any elites to kill. Oh wait, we've got a few more to do. No, okay, still no elites to kill. Oh, one left, all right. There we go, at least we killed someone, eh? So uh, like I said, we're fire team Osiris, so we've got our fire team with us. Um, it's quite a new addition to a Halo game, actually. It's quite funky. We've got a tanker. Buck's back, as you can see, and we've got Vale. And um, these guys are following Locke. And today what we're doing is we're wrestling Halsey from the Covenant. So let's get in there, shoot some guys, pull her out, you know, standard Spartan stuff. So right now we're rocking with the old DMR, which you gotta love, which is doing its job very nicely. And we're fighting some Forerunner dogs here. They can get down quite easily. And um, also some grunts. Oh, actually, there's quite a few of them here. Might need to concentrate a little bit. There we go. All right, they're down. Are you guys really all fighting one dog? Come on, but. So the nice thing about your fire team is we can actually tell them to do certain things. So right there, I've just told them to focus on that one grunt while um, I come around the side, which is pretty funky. And not only just focus, we can also tell them to um, move. So for example, I can tell them all to get over there. So we can take a different approach to this and they can go around one side. Meanwhile, oh, oh he's suiciding. God. <laughs> See you later, mate. <laughs> oh, suicide grunts, they always make me chuckle. Oh, Nerdler, the beautiful pink mist destroys everything. Oh, yep. It's dead, Vale. It's it's dead. Leave it. Come on, guys. Let's move up. God, she's horrible, she is. She just, you know, keeps shooting things no matter how dead they are. All right, so, oh, hello. Oh, up the cliffs. oh, that's new. I don't normally do that. Let's get up here and... Um, what they're doing. I just think I'll just punch them this time. Oh, no, no, they're still flying Soldier forward. All right. Do that ice wall. Oh, suppressor. Now, this is kind of like the, um, it's like an SMG, really. It's pretty funky. Absolutely rinses through. Things. So, these guys, oh, explode into lovely fur. Fur? That's not fur. Uh, I know what fur is. That's definitely not it. Particles, that's the word I'm looking for. Completely different word. Well done. All sides. So let's take these Prometheans down. So these guys look like they kind of, well, you shoot them for a bit and then they explode a little bit and then you've got to shoot that core bit in the middle of them to actually finish them off. Pretty funky. What have we got here? Ah, oh, the light rifle. Now this is one of my favorite guns. A little bit of distance to it and it just wrecks things like this. See that one shot on that dog took it out. Absolutely brilliant. So once again, we're gonna tell our fire team to um, take the low road while we take the high road. Um, we're gonna blitz up here and take down these Prometheans. So once again, we've got to shoot the glowy bit in their chest and actually take them down. A nice new little addition to this game as well. Locke's got this charge ability, which is pretty funky. I can show you it now. There you go. <laughs> Absolutely kicks them across the map. Brilliant. Oh, okay, not that time. That time I just did it into a wall, you know. Never mind. <laughs> Come on, get down. Oh, I'm actually hurting. That's not good. I don't want to die, that'd be very embarrassing, especially on normal mode. Come on, guys, push up. Take that soldier down. <laughs> you got to deal with that one first. There you go. Come on. Get in there. There we go. I like how the... Um, your fire team actually reacts to you as well when they're in the middle of a battle and you're telling them to go do something else. They're actually saying, no, I've got to kill this guy first. A little bit of um, intuition from them, it's quite funky. And you can see when they're getting hurt as well, they actually retreat back and take a bit of cover rather than just stand there and die, which 
we have seen in previous games. Obviously not Halo, because, you know, Halo is normally pretty tight for its AI. It's one of the great things that I've always enjoyed about it. And it's, it is nice to have a team back again as well. I mean, we haven't seen a team since Halo Reach. Normally, it's just Chief, Chief and more Chief, which, I mean, I don't have a problem with that. I'm a big Chief fan. I love the old Chief. I mean, I'm not sure about killing him in this, but, you know, needs must. But, um, yeah, like I was saying, in Halo Reach, obviously, you had your whole team with you, so it was more than just the one-man army, which meant they should do it. if your friends came and joined you, you weren't just running around with loads of the same character. You are actually running around with different members of the team, whereas now, obviously, that's the same thing. So you could be Locke, someone else could be Tanker, someone could be Buck, and some Doors unfortunate open. person could be Vale. Um, you know, just adds a nice bit of a new dynamic to the game. Alright, so... Some more people to kill then, that's what we're looking for. Whoa! Kraken? Tell me about it. It's huge! Look at the size of the thing. I want to see the rest of it. How big is that thing? If that's just one arm. Right. Let's get in there. Ooh! Hello. People facing the other way. Well, we know what we've got to do here, don't we? <laughs> Stab Grunt in the forehead. <laughs> oh, can, we get, can we get the elite? I want to get the elite. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Alright, we'll shoot the rest of them. Oh, wow. That's the rest of the um, Kraken then. It's pretty big. Sorry. I'll stop gazing at the scenery for a moment and shoot some things, otherwise I'm going to die. I love the sound of this gun as well. It's like pew pew. <laughs> sounds fantastic. Oh, oh, spiky ones. Now, the normal ones aren't too bad, but those spiky ones take a little bit more of a damage. Oh, let's go through here. Oh, that was not what I meant to do. There we go. So, you can use this new charge ability to smash through bits of the map, which is pretty cool. Opens up new bits of the area for you. Go through. Alright, so. Oh, I was actually going to come up here and get that big gun, but you just dropped it down for me. That's very nice of you, wasn't it? So, we'll go back down and grab it. Where is it? Now, this thing is brilliant. It's just a big cannon. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, Danker. Yeah. Make sure you haven't got a teammate in front of you when you're firing a giant cannon. Sorry, I forgot that. That's Spartan 101 there. Right. So, oh, really? It's not going very well. Grenades going off all over the place. Alright, I'm going to leave that thing for a second. Take out some of these. Where did he come from? There. Okay. Now they're all dead. Let's move on, eh? Come on, guys. Let's push up. Alright, so a few more Prometheans to take out here, and a few more dogs. So what I reckon I'm going to do here... Oh, and there's two big guys with turrets as well. Alright, I reckon my team can go and stand in the middle, and then, you know, they can take most of the damage, and I can go around the outside and kill all the baddies, as I long to do. Another one down there. I do like the animations when these guys die, it's very cool. Oh, hello. Alright, I think you probably want a grenade in your face, don't you? There you go. That worked. There we go. Alright, come on team, push up. Keep going forward. I like how they're responding to it, but copy, Roger. You know, they're taking my commands. It's good. I like being team leader. <laughs> come on. There we go. One left. Oh, cool. Oh, they've got the charge ability as well. I didn't realise that. Oh, that's pretty funky. All right, then. Let's push forward into this poor runner structure. Looks pretty funky, in it? Like the decor? What do you think, guys? Come on! What are you doing? Pick up. It was only a matter of time. Come on, guys. Right. What guns we got here? Well, if it's stand up break a ah, More the same. I've got my favourites now anyway, so I'm not too fussed. Oh what's, oh, what's this? Oh, date pads, more of these. So, there's lots of hidden things around the levels, as in any Halo game. You know, they love their Easter eggs, as do we. And um, so here we've got some intel. And I also saw on the start menu as well, there's a skull somewhere on this map. Sadly, I haven't found it, but hopefully at some time I will. And, um, let's just take a second. It's so pretty. 
Death and destruction on a global scale. It's brilliant, isn't it? Especially in high death. Right, anyway. Pushing on. Let's go kill some things. Oh. Knights. Oh wow, some knights. Wow. They've got swords. Did they have swords beforehand? Don't let them through the holes. I'm pretty sure they didn't have swords beforehand. I don't know. It's been a while since I've played a Halo game. Right. Oh, grunt. Now, these guys aren't easy to kill. <laughs> now, these guys are not quite sure. Alright. Oh, okay. I see. Shoot the yellow, glowing yellow bits. Makes sense. Alright. I think everyone needs to focus on him. Because, you know, they do take a lot of damage to go down. Alright, there's another one dead. Come on. Shoot him. There we go. Oh. Ah, oh, scatter shot. Brilliant. Promethean shotgun. Absolutely brilliant, this thing. <laughs> you just. Oh, okay, don't look at me. Come on. Go down. Please go down. Oh, wow. He's taking a lot of damage. I've got to shoot him in those bits. There we go. Alright, now in the head. Come on. Stop. Oh, no. Oh, that's no good. Got him down to no health there whatsoever, and he's come over and killed me. I do like the fact that you can actually get your teammates to pick you up in this game, though. Unlike other Halos where it's straight down and you're dead. I'm sure that's what's going to happen in the Legendary playthroughs, though. Which I will be doing at some point, but not today. So, um, well, I think that's all the guys now. And um, I think we're at the end of the level. So thanks for watching guys, that's um, another gameplay of Halo 5, so cheers and I'll see you in the next one.